guys welcome back to my channel today's diy video is about how you can make your own laundry detergent and fabric softener using young living essential oils let's get started you're going to need a container borax super washing soda epsom salt baking soda two boxes of zote laundry flakes a pair of gloves your choice of essential oils in a glass jar so to make the fabric softener you're gonna take two cups of Epsom salt and then you're gonna add 10 drops of each essential oil so let's talk about these essential oils that I'm using one is purification and the other is lavender so for purification it is a blend of citronella lavender lemongrass rosemary myrtle and tea tree which is a great odor neutralizer and then you have lavender which is a very versatile essential oil and it has a scent of fresh floral clean and calm so again you're going to add 10 drops of each essential oil into the epsom salt and then you're going to mix everything together <laughs> So after you mix that together, you're going to repeat the steps. So you're going to add two more cups of Epsom salt. So you're going to need four all together. And then you're going to add 10 drops of each essential oil and then mix everything together again and then place everything to the side. All right, to make the actual laundry detergent, you're gonna take two cups of the baking soda, one box of the laundry flakes, two cups of the super washing soda, two cups of borax, and then you're going to add um, a half of the jar of the fabric softener, and then you're gonna take your gloves and mix everything together and mix it well. All right, just like the fabric softener, you're gonna repeat all the steps. So two cups of the baking soda, two cups of borax, two cups of the super washing soda, a box of the laundry flakes, and then you're gonna use the rest of the jar of the fabric softener and you're gonna mix everything together. <laughs> All right, so for storage, you can place everything in a glass container because you are using essential oils, or you can keep everything in the container that you use to mix all the contents and then just add a scoop. So that completes today's video. If you guys have any questions, make sure you leave it in the comment section below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And until the next time, I will see you guys later. Bye.